Hello friends, today we are going to draw a snake. Have you ever wondered why snakes stick their tongues out? They are probably trying to smell their surroundings. Some snakes can be very dangerous as they are venomous. The snakes to look out for the black mamba, king cobra, inland taipan and lots more. There are around 600 venomous snakes. Have you ever wondered how snakes can hunt in the dark? They can sense the heat of their prey using the two holes in their face, called pits. If you see on our snake face, we just draw them, two holes above the snake mouth. This makes it very hard to hide from snake. Snakes can grow very long, which means they have hundreds of ribs. That's much more than humans. We only have 24 ribs. They need them just like us to protect their organs. Snakes shed their skin between 4-12 times a year. This is because snakes are always growing. However, their skin doesn't grow with them. Their old layer of skin becomes too tight for them, and so they have to shed it. They then have a nice new layer of skin underneath. You know snakes are fast? Snakes can travel really fast, but the black mamba is the fastest. It can travel up to 12 miles per hour. Did you know the longest snakes is over 6 meters long? It's called a python. It's huge and chunky snake. Our snake that we draw is cute, green. I like it and it's not scary at all. I hope you learned something new today. I'm going to color my snake green, but you don't have to. You can choose any color you like, or you can choose multiple colors. I would like to keep my snake plain without any patterns, but if you want to, you can add any pattern on snake back or on the snake belly. In the nature you see, snakes can be all different co colors and they have very pretty patterns on them. Sometimes tiny circles, sometimes dots, spots, or it could be lines, with diamond shape patterns. I color my snake pretty quick, but you can take your time. You can use multiple tools. You can use markers, crayons, paint. And let's think of a name. I would like to call my snake um, Tommy. Tommy is one of my favorite snakes. It's just like in the cartoon Tommy and Jerry. But here I think name Tommy will suit my green cute snake. What would you call your snake? I think our snake looks pretty friendly. When I was a child, I used to be scared of snakes. Are you scared? But now I'm not scared at all. Look, I decided to add even little blush on my snake chick. It's so pretty. I wish all the snakes in nature were that pretty. But you know it's not true and you have to be careful. I'm sure snakes hunt only if they need to for food. And if you're careful and you're not touching them, they will not touch you either. Now we're going to add little shading which will add texture to our snake. I'm drawing little horizontal lines on the snake belly and all around snake's body. Our snake body is not that long if you see. I think it's a baby snake. Who knows? Maybe in few years it will grow into a big fat snake. 
our snake is so green that if it will climb on the tree, I doubt we can see it. I hope you learned something interesting today. Bye bye for now. Thank you and join me for the next lesson.